Hello, Fangrafer here, getting back to more Let's Play Doom. Now, things are probably gonna take a different turn for uh, episode 3 of um, Doom here, or chapter 3, not to confuse the game with the Let's Play series. Um, if I recall correctly, the rest of chapter 3's levels are extremely long, so... Depending on how long time it takes me to beat the level and what the timer says, I might be uh, uh, only doing one level per video. Also pointed out to me by Metal Smasher, um, the Cyber Demon is indeed in Doom 2, and. Uh, Two interesting things about Hell's Keep. First of all, the song is based on uh, Mouth of uh, Mouth of War uh, by Pantera, and there is a secret in that level, and it's activated close to the end. That's something I didn't know. But about the music, though, I do know about it because I've been writing the uh, bonus material for this last night. So I'll talk more about the music in the bonus video. So for now, let's continue on with Pandemonium. Kicking off with a Pinky Demon and Imp. Now, this is a bit of a mace type level. I'm lucky these guys don't tend to drop stuff, so don't worry about you know, killing a demon and then be like, oh shit, I can't get what he eventually dropped. Because the only enemies to drop something are uh, humanoid enemies like uh, zombie riflemen and uh, shotgun zombies, as well as a enemy in Doom 2. But that's about it. Hello there, Kako Demon. Now, can you please die? Here we go. Oh god. Here we go. It felt like something was in there somewhere and just waiting for me. The way hitting this to activate this road forward containing. Imps, and I definitely need to get shotgun shells. Well, ask and you shall receive, pretty much. Get some armor. The berserk power up. And let's try to find something. Never mind, I was about to say let's find something to beat up, but I think I ran out. Here we go. That door doesn't open. Okay, we get a chain gun. Hey, look, it's another Baron of Hell. Once again. Again, he's gonna soak up a lot of ammo, so... Take something rapid-fire, like plasma rifle or chain gun to deal with him. If I recall, there should be more than just one of those buggers around here. Get some shotgun shells. Those new to my channel... And viewers of uh, uh, people like Pink Kitty Rose, Shag, or even uh, Roam might send some 
obvious inspirations from the latter, aka uh, Roam. And that's because, well, like I said in my 5 year anniversary video, Roam Mithril is indeed the main inspiration for me. While Chuggy Conroy was the first Let's Player I ever saw, he didn't really... Oh my god. He didn't quite... inspire me as, as much as Roam and uh, Proton John did. Hmm. I definitely feel like I'm like I'm being watched somewhere around here. Oh, health pickups. Yeah, I forgot to mention that this area around the start contains a lot of goodies, so save those for when you absolutely need them. You should die. Thank you very much. I think hitting that that only gives me. Hey, give me a shotgun. So up here we have a nice little pathway. Here we go, get those. I don't think there's anything else in there. No, it isn't. Oh! Sure, just stand there and take it. <laughs> That's definitely how you play Doom. Just stand there and take everything that the game throws at you. Uh. So, through here... I know there should be enemies around here somewhere. Like a lost soul, for instance. Some health. Check this way. I definitely recommend that you exercise caution around here. Just take it slow. And yeah, up there they decide to harm you, so... Be careful. Yeah, like I said, exercise caution around this area. Because you never know if something is hiding behind the corner. Hmm. Nothing, so let's bring down the switch or the elevator again. Let's see if we can find a blue door hidden. Well, that, brought in, that brought down. I'm an idiot, they didn't really bring down stairs. They were already here. <laughs> hmm. Do this. Yep. Lost soul. Nothing. Oh, we finally found it! Say hello to the BFG 9000. Oh yes, is right. The BFG 9000 stands for, of course, the big fucking gun 9000. It's the best weapon in the game, and if I had this against a cyber demon, I would have been less tense. This thing rips through the cyber demon and the final boss of the game in a few shots. 
This thing devastates enemies like nobody's business and the splash damage with it is ridiculous. Alright. Head through this area, get the supercharge. And back down. Well, we can still head down these stairs. Okay, we have a Spectre. And some invulnerability. It can be really difficult to see where you're heading with this on, so this might be the only good thing with uh, Uh, with uh, having the map as it is originally. Okay, I've seen one part of the map that isn't filled in correctly. And it's over here. Okay, we have this pathway. Giving us the mega armor and stim pack, should we need it. That opened up a secret area with map and medkits. But we need to go here because we had the blue key so we can go in here. Deal with you. And we have the exit here. Nothing else. And no enemy hiding the, uh, holding the exit. And yeah, like I said, this level took me a while to beat, so it's gonna be the only one for tonight. So expect at least a level per video uh, from now on. So that means that tomorrow night. We're going into the House of Pain. And if that guy is any indication, this is going to be painful. See you guys then. Bye bye.